Hello and welcome to another episode of Stem to Stern. I'm Tom with Harbor Side Marine and Yacht Sales, and the keen-eyed viewers among you may have noticed we're not at the marina today. We're in fact actually at Mohegan Sun for the 2020 Hartford Boat Show. Um, today we're going to be showing you a 2020 Sea Hunt 25 game fish, so come on aboard and let me show you around. Let's uh, start up at the helm here. New upgrades for 2020, uh, as with all the boats of the Raptor Ride Windshield. This is now tempered safety glass instead of acrylic, uh, which means it's going to hold up a lot better long term for you. Uh, the power windshield flap is now slightly larger. Um, this boat is specced out with a 12 inch Garmin, uh, which is very, very nice. And uh, you have your JL audio system and you have your Yamaha command link screen. And the nice thing with modern electronics is that they all talk, they're all on the same network which means you can control absolutely everything from your one big Garmin screen. Uh, another cool thing that's new for 2020, and you wouldn't know unless you know, or have watched this video, um, there is a wireless phone charger hidden in behind the dash here, so that um, all you have to do if you have a newer phone that supports wireless charging is slide your phone in, and you can charge all day long while you're out fishing, DJing, and whatever you need to do. Um, you have push button start, you have the key right here, um, up here you have your matching Garmin VHF radio. Um, something that's sort of unique to Sea Hunt is they have the freshwater misters built into the T-top that on a nice hot summer day will put out a nice fine atomized mist, cool you right down. Um, this boat in particular is specced out with the King Rod holders, uh, which is good for trawling. Uh, as with all their models, they have the flip up and down seat bolsters and armrests. And you have the foot pad down here. And if you're a little bit shorter, you have the foot bar right here. So that way you're always comfortable. Come around back here. You can see this has a uh, live well right here. And you have some knife and hook storage right here as well. Uh, again, you have another uh, live well right here. And all the live wells are lit and circulate. And then right in the transom here, you have a big fish box. So the uh, 25 Game Fish is actually a slightly different hull from the 255 Ultra. And what that means is it's a little bit bigger in all the dimensions. And what it really allows you to do is carry twin outboards. This one is spec'd with um, twin 150 Yamahas. All Sea Hunts come with nothing but Yamaha. So really great package. Um, really, really aids in uh, close quarters maneuverability when you're coming into dock. Uh, makes your life a lot more simple and civilized. Uh, another benefit of the 25 game fish is that it allows for a integrated uh, bow anchor as opposed to having one deck mounted. So it's a much cleaner look. Um, you get 25 feet of chain and then 175 feet of rope road. Uh, you can actuate the windlass from buttons up on the foredeck. Uh, and I'll show you that in a sec. Or you can actuate it from a switch on the dash. Um, so let's move on up forward. As you can see up here, um, nice big seating area. And these backrests actually come out and can be locked in or taken off the boat altogether. Uh, this middle piece comes out, as you can see, so that you can take this out so you have more walking around space up here. Or if you've got the wife and kids out, you can have a big sun pad up here. Uh, as I mentioned before, you have a uh, in the hull anchor and the windlass is actually under that hatch right there. Uh, and you have the two buttons to actuate the windlass. Uh, you have the nice integrated powder coated grab rails all the way around the bow here that are flushed in. So it makes a nice clean look and it means you're also you're not going to be tripping over anything. Uh, up here you have a forward steaming light. So if you're coming in at night, people can see you and you can see what's going on. I'll uh, swing around this side. I can show you in the console. So if you look in here, this is new for 2020. You get the um, non-skid matting down there. Uh, another upgrade for 2020 is you now get the actual dedicated ladder storage space. That ladder goes on the side of the boat when you have the side door open, and that way you can go diving off the side door and climb back safely away from the props. Uh, other thing you probably noticed while you were in there is it has a legit porcelain marine head, not a port -a bucket So um, much more civilized. It can either be pumped out at the dock, or if you're far enough offshore, it can be pumped offshore through a Y-valve and a macerator. Um, I think that's about it for this boat, and uh, until next time, I'm Tom with Harborside, and I'll see you guys out on the water. 